The Lord bless me with a house. You better have that same faith to make that house payment. You better make that same. You better. You better have that same faith to make that apartment payment. Wherever well, you're dwelling at. Y'all hear what I'm saying? She's going to fall out with God because, amen, they got the downside. If, if God won't be the downside, I ain't going to feel embarrassed, baby. I'm just downsizing, baby. Y'all ain't saying nothing. I don't need to supersize in this season. Give me a, give me a, give me a dollar value. Y'all ain't saying nothing. Some years ago, amen, many years ago, Amen. We uh, went in, uh, and uh, they they, uh, they 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 say, well, we go we go finance you, Amen. And they took the tie and they put it. They took my, my white band, yeah. our white band, and they took the tag over and everything and this and that. And and, and uh and I have some power steering. I you know I, I you know yeah, yeah. Uh, you know I was you know I had to start cutting up. <laughs> and, I, and I put mo I'll put money in, in 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 you know alcohol in the party and and I and, and I could I could have been got the power steering pump fit. I, I I was so jacked up I would put power steering fluid in that till I had to. <laughs> but what happened was uh they they came back uh we had a it was a kill and it was that that year. And it was no matter fresh. We had it for a whole month. Yeah. Uh, 2005. 2005. We had it a whole month. A whole month. And they called and said, Well, we couldn't get y'all with it. And Pastor said, Well, how, 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 what do you mean? I'm going to go get my car. We still got a car. What do you mean? They were called, they, I think, well, we had it for, I think we, we rolled out time. We did everything. You know what I'm saying? And we still came back to a car. What? I learned how to find God. I was a little jacked up, but I still knew how to find God. And I never lost my gratefulness. I, I never, I never, I never, I never lost my gratefulness. I said, I'm going to show you. you, you I, I, I'm going to show you. You don't want to get in? I, I mean, I'm going to get in there. Crunk that bug on up and kept on going. Y'all hear what I'm saying? Amen. And got, and got back on track, got back in the will of God, and things went to, come on, somebody, went to picking up. Come on, somebody. Amen, somebody. Went to picking up. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. And not long after that, amen, went back, went and got one, amen, faithful, panic, amen, and then when God brought us out over, amen, went back to the same place that we had a dream about another kill, amen, and then they came up, they said, y'all approved, this is a done deal. Just go take that one, surrender that van back. I'm in a contract. Surrender that van back. Take that back to my riders. The same place I had to take the other one back and get in the old one. God swooped us out right there. Y'all ain't talking to me. You better get it. Same place. That season, God will put you in the spirit of gratefulness. When it don't go your way, are you still grateful? Could you still find Kool-Aid in the midst of a cantaloupe? Y'all ain't saying that. I feel God pushing right now. Hallelujah. And he said, he about shout, I got to be grateful. Amen. For then for these we are once enjoyed, or these we enjoy now. Look at somebody say it's time for you to enjoy now. Time for you to enjoy now. 
time for you to enjoy now. Stand still and consider the wonderful, the wondrous, the wondrous works of God. Stand still and consider. 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 Grace. Consider. Everything ain't what it looked like. I consider. Other words, it may be a door closed, but I consider another door. I may have to take some pill, but I consider my healing. Y'all hear me? The wonder, wonderful works of God. Job was in places in his life, but he still considered God's works. And as a believer, we always got to consider God's works. Because as soon as we shut God off and try to get it our way, that's when we make a mess of the place. Because when you're in a place and you need change, you need the changer. You need the changer. You don't need the messer. We need the changer. And that is Christ Jesus. That's Christ Jesus. Everybody say it's Christ Jesus. Christ Jesus. Job 37, 14, that's where you can find that at. A content mind is the greatest blessings a man can ever enjoy in this world. A sober mind. A mind filled with peace. Contentment. Job said, whatever state that I may be in, I'm there for contentment. I mean, Paul. Paul knew how to be, he knew how it felt to be broke. Having the money. Push the, the ministry to push the vision. He knew how it felt to be healed and be sick. He knew how it felt to be loved and be uh, 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 out for the slaughter. Everybody say, I got to have a content, contented, contented mind. Thank you, God. To complete with someone or for something. To complete with a good chance of winning. That's where our mind got to be. I'm a winner, not a failure. I'm more than a conqueror. Yeah, though they slay me, I still trust. I was born to win. It's a fish fight. It's already fixed. Amen. But we got to have a content, contented Mind. Amen. If I say my mind. My mind. My mind. mind. My mind. That's where the devil want to fight. That's where the devil fight. When you have an idle mind, all those illusions will come up. This person don't like me. Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus. You know they don't like you because you walk up on the wrong shoe. You ain't pray like you ought to pray. Because you know if you don't pray like you ought to pray, spirits get on you. Spirits will get on you. You don't have a life of godliness. Spirits will get on you. I don't care who you are. Spirits will get on you. You get grouchy. You don't know why you're grouchy. 
Some folks, some church folks worse than folks that's on substance. When they can't get their substance, they go to. You got some church folks coming to church and then. Worse than the Georgia boy people. Yeah, I don't need nobody. I don't need nobody. I don't need nobody. Stop lying. You need that cashier to get that grocery. Come on. Unless you going to jail. Then you gonna need a bondman to get out of jail. So pick and choose who you going I'd rather have the people for my life. Amen. Church folk will never grow if we have that mentality that I don't need nobody. Because when that spirit go to talking like that, you not loving properly. Amen, somebody. You put off your blessings. He said, I give people for your life. Amen. They not going to show up just to look good. They going to show up to push you. To enhance you. To bless you. To encourage you. Amen. Did anybody like it so good? Reflect upon your present blessings. Reflect upon your present. Your present blessings. Somebody say my right now blessing. Don't let the future aggravate you. Your faith is not for the future. It's for the right now. Your hope is for the good. Faith is something they hope for. I'm hoping that I'm going to get what I've been praying for. That's why I'm not going to let the devil take me out of my present faith right now. So what profit a man to gain the whole world? If God lose his soul, I got to stay in King Jesus. I got to stay in the will of God. I need faith right now. We'll deal with it on tomorrow. But we're going to deal with it right now. Amen. Amen. Whoa, glory. Glory, God. Deal with it right now. Right now. now, I ain't telling you not to save now. I ain't telling you not to save your money. I, I, the, the, you, right. you, you, you know, I'm going to write the Bible. I ain't telling you don't save your money for rain today and stuff. I ain't telling you not to do that. Amen. Because, you know, you, you, we ought to have some hope that we're going to live. Amen. 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 So, oh, I'm, 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 I'm going to spend all my money right now. I'm, I'm just going to live right now for the day. I'm going to live right now. <laughs> oh, glory. That's the wrong mentality. So now reflect upon your present blessing. How many times we really reflect on our daily blessings? How? How many times do we really reflect on our daily blessings out of a run of a day? Out of a run of a day. And you know what? If, 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 if it must be a pole in the body of Christ, how many people in, in the house of the Lord really pray? Really pray and have that quality relationship with Christ. The percentage would not be very high. You know why? You know why? Because if the percentage was high, it would be so much hell. Jesus whooped them out of the temple. Say, this should be a house of prayer. So wherever prayer come in at, if prayer reside in us, prayer say I'll shut it down. Oh Lord have mercy. I just prayed for something yesterday, and I'm not gonna let you get something in my spirit that's gonna hold up what I just asked God for. The devil is a lie. By the fact you and them get up on my face. We got to understand that. I feel the Holy Ghost. 
When you understand I'm not a garbage can, I'm not a garbage can. But I'm a collector of the word. I'm not a garbage can, but I'm a collector of the word of God. I need to eat my daily bread. I need to suffer with him. We operate with him. If you don't want to go, go to him to me. Because I'm counting my blessings. I'm thinking about my blessings. Matter of fact, the more I think about my blessings, I'm expecting one right about now. Y'all ain't saying that. I'm expecting one right about now. Y'all ain't saying that. I'm expecting a blessing right about now. The blessing right about now. That never trying to hold your blessing back. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. I will labor for this. I've been dogged out for this. I've been talked about. I've been exercised. I put your ain't saying that. Give me a little nose over this mic. I feel a push right about now. Give me back five up in here. Send you. To bless, to let mess take me up out of the kingdom, to let the mess pull me up out of my promise. Somebody shout glory. Somebody shout glory. Because when I look back over my life, I can tell somebody I thank God for my mother, I thank God for my daddy. But when I really look back over my life, it wasn't daddy deliver me. It wasn't my good mama deliver me. It was a man named King Jesus. And when I fell in love with it, he turned my life upside down. When I fell in love with it, he told me I'm better than what I was. When I fell in love with it, he told me to do that with me. I'll be a greater friend than them. So I had to cut those Negroes off and talk with a new friend. Look at your neighbor say, neighbor, he'll be a friend. You stick close to the brother. You must search all over, but you can't find nobody. Then I do you like Jesus. He's a comforter in the midnight hour. He is my tear drop with tears from my pillow. He heals. Somebody shout, he heals, he heals. He heals, he heals. He heals. He heals. How could you reflect on your blessings when you don't forget about your blessings? Take me some high time. When you don't forget about your blessings. Y'all ain't saying that. Y'all right now. The devil wants you to forget all about your blessings. God done set you pocket beans and weenies. You want a steak with the back of my food. Come on, somebody. Y'all ain't talking to me up in the hill. The doctor said one thing. Uh, but it ain't what the doctor said. Uh, God reduced that thing down. Uh, I may have a little cold. Uh, but thank God ain't got no more. Uh, Y'all ain't saying that up in the hill. Uh, I feel some pushing me right about now. Because when I look over my life, when I think on the goodness of Jesus and all that he done for me, come on the inside. Y'all hear what I'm saying? The Holy Ghost, the hope of glory. Begin to jump. Come on, somebody. Yeah, he's doing the jumping. Come on. Uh, Y'all ain't saying that. I, I got the same, I got that same thing. Amen. That same it. Amen. That was jumping in Mary Elizabeth belly. That is the Holy Ghost. But God added the fire. Y'all ain't saying that. Look at your neighbor's and neighbor. You need Holy Ghost and fire. You cannot. I need fire that will suck up water. I need the fire that will suck up heartaches. I need the fire. What you say? 
So now where we at? Reflect upon your present blessings of which every man has many not on your own past misfortunes of which all man have some. So now we got to understand if it's ever hour in a season and a time we got to let God's will be up in us. We got to let God's will be up in us. Now, if you're in a place and that's not God's will, the spiritual gifts ought to be. God, this ain't what you said. This ain't what you promised me. This ain't what it's supposed to look like. Yeah. Oh, get God in mind. Because what happened is, us church folks will start accepting things that God say, wait a minute, why you letting the devil hit you on the head like that? What, 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 what wrong with you? I didn't make you a punching bag. I made you a lion. Come on, somebody. I made you to be a praiser. Come on, where the lion of Judah at? Come on. Where the praises at? Come on. Where the praises, amen, begin to get on your lips. That devil got to slap. Hold on, I thought I shut their mouth last night. They got a hold of them. And they can't hold their peace. Good part of mine. They can't hold their peace. I want to be with the noisy crew. Y'all ain't saying nothing. When we begin to open up our mouth and shout to the trump of Zion, we ought to have some anointing sound. We don't need no any sound. We need the sound of the devil respect. The devil got to recognize that he got to get up out of here. My praise is for real. Ain't got time for false praise. Ain't got time for, for praise, character praise. Uh, amen. I praise him when he giving me something. The devil is a lie. When he woke me up this morning, uh, if he don't give me nothing else, uh, he gave me another chance. Uh, if I was wrong, he got me to get it right. Uh, when I won't miss heaven and go to hell, uh, that's better than a rose rocks. Uh, that's better than a million dollars. Because we got to understand if that devil shut you down in the house of God, I can imagine what he's doing at home. I want to fuck you today. Shout when you don't feel like shouting. Talk when you don't feel like talking. Do your hair when you don't feel like doing your hair. Put on some clothes when you don't feel like it. All I know the devil ain't let me bound. Cause I've been bound with a price. Somebody say it. I'm supposed to beat you. I'm supposed to beat you. Somebody gonna leave up out of here more grateful. Somebody gonna have a bigger picture of Jesus and how he done redeemed them from the curse of the law. Yo, he said that if he broke me out of the curse of the law, well, I'm gonna put up with everything in the greater covenant. Hallelujah. And we go here and we say, joy is not in things. Joy is not in vain. And, 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 and see, that's where the body of Christ go wrong. 
They feel like they got to have stuff to feel blessed. They got to be in a bigger church to feel blessed. You can be in a bigger church and God ain't in the church. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You can put him on the sign, but if he ain't put a step of approval and sat down in that ministry, y'all ain't saying that. It just wasn't real. Come on, somebody. But I want to be in a motivated ministry. I want to be in the fire flow. I want to be, y'all ain't talking to me up in here. I'm looking for signs and wonders. I need to hear a word that it would set me free. So joy is not in vain. When we get out of things, God will get in us. Somebody say it is it is it is in us. The joy that you have, it ought to come from. I'm going to help you up in here. You want to be some mountain movers? The time you ought to be moving mountain. Listen. I teach y'all you never off. When you are a believer, you never off. This ain't no secular job. You clock in and clock out. You never off. Somebody looking for a word of encouragement. You don't need the pulpit to minister. You can, I ain't talking to me. Your smile can minister to somebody. Your kindness can minister to somebody. I don't know who I'm talking to, but you got to understand that your greatest gift is love. And when the love get down on the inside, that'll bring that jaw, unspeakable jaw. Y'all ain't saying that my tongue may be aching, but Lord, I thank God huh, that I got nine ain't aching. Huh? And if I got nine ain't aching, huh? I know you ain't able to deliver this other town. Come on, you ain't got too many warfare preachers because they don't want to go through heavy warfare. Y'all ain't saying nothing. But when I done went through the storm, I done been lying on. The devil tried to shut my mouth, shut the minister down. The only the truth saying, baby. Only the truth saying, baby. And if God wasn't with me, I would be shut down. Lord. <laughs> Y'all hear what I'm saying? See, we got to understand. You ain't got too many warfare preachers. Huh? Come on, you got them. You got preachers want the money. You got folk that got good. Uh, 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 they, they, they got good words. But I love what Paul said. I didn't come with excellent words. Huh? I didn't come with all that mess. Huh? But I come with demonstrations. Huh? Y'all ain't saying that. Huh? People need to be set free. Huh? Folk need to be challenged. Huh? Don't come up out of that. Up, huh? Come on, God got use for you. Huh? Come on, I'm out of there. Huh? You better than that. Huh? God got something for you. Y'all ain't saying that. I feel God. Somebody shot this joy. And my joy need to be restored. Because somebody done terminated my joy. Somebody done jacked up my joy. Because you done lost the drug, your joy gone. You done lost your business, your joy gone. You done lost your best dog, your joy gone. You done lost some stuff, your joy gone. People don't walk the way you ain't taking no more. You done lost your joy. What's the matter, you better get connected to the joy, huh? because when you get Jesus, huh, everything, huh, you'll be all right. Huh? I'm about to preach up in here. Huh? We need to draw the law. Huh? Have to build the right, huh? but I still got joy. Huh? I may not be right, huh? but I ain't gonna let my fire out. Huh? Look at your neighbor and neighbor. Huh? What's, the What's the problem? 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 With your joy. 
when you draw, when you draw, tell that devil, say, devil, you ain't taking my joy. I don't cry my last year. I don't give up the right to the wrong. You ain't taking my joy. I'm going to fight a good fight of faith because the race is not giving. So if you're looking at my ability, devil, you done lost. If you're looking at my strength, devil, you done lost. So watch me. Hold on. Every trap, every enemy, every liar, hold on. Because after a while, when the glory shows, we're going to find out who holy, who sanctify, who kill. With the Holy Ghost, somebody say yes. Somebody say yes. Somebody say yes. Somebody say yes. Somebody shout joy. That devil was that devil wanna put something in your ear to kill your joy. Get out of and kill your joy. I'm gonna teach you to be big in kingdom. I ain't standing for less. I serve the best. Y'all be saying that. You ain't taking my job. Y'all ain't saying that. I ain't throwing in the towel. Because great is he that is in me. That is in the world. Hallelujah. When he flooded the earth, come on, with Noah, come on. He put a promise there with the rainbow, come on. He ain't gonna flood it, come on. But it's gonna be by fire this time, come on. Y'all ain't saying that. You better look at your promise. Stop looking at that problem. That book of man, that muscle. When the problem get big, it's just right for God. But I'm looking for a promise. I know you're looking at me right now, but I'm seeing past this here. See the promise. Huh? I don't have to have yellow, red, and yellow, and white, and all of that. I see the promise of the word. Oh. 
Look at your neighbor and say, Are you looking at the promise? Are you looking at your ability? You looking at the promise or you looking at your ability? Y'all ain't saying that. I told you, when you looking at the promise, uh, you locked in the God. Uh, and when you locked in the God, uh, the grace, uh, the supernatural uh, will come on your nature. Uh, and it cause you to do something uh, that you couldn't get done. Uh, when man say no, uh, God say yes. Uh, when the application go in. Uh, uh, wait, let me look again. Let me look again. I'm the prophet. Y'all ain't saying that. Y'all ain't saying that. Y'all ain't saying that. If I believe the promise and see the promise, is, you got prophets want to prophesy, but they don't believe what they say because they believe in the money in the pockets. They preaching out the 50 Lucas. Y'all ain't saying that. Well, if God don't say it, I won't say it. Because if God said it, I'm looking for the breakthrough. I'm looking for the promise to be manifested. Won't he do it, Brother Evil? Won't he do it, Sister Evil? Come on, somebody. Won't he do it? Won't he turn around, Sister, Sister, Sister Angel? Won't he turn it around? When he turn it around, when I told you it's gonna be all right, it's gonna be all right. She gonna have it. The devil is a lie. Y'all ain't seen that. I believe God, but if I don't believe it, I might well put the locks on the doors. But the devil is a lie. He didn't deliver me from my attitude, from my alcohol. Just come in the house of God and spread a lie. Uh, but somebody uh, want to be delivered. Uh, I want to tell you in here. Uh, if you want to be delivered, uh, all you got to do is uh, say, Lord, uh, create in me uh, a clean heart. Uh, clean my mind first. Uh, clean my mind first. Uh, clean my spirit in. Uh, let's clean my stomach uh, where I can pass. Look at your neighbor and say, baby, you got to fast. These times come out by fasting and praying. We got to fast. We got to go into consecration. We got to have a life of dedication. And y'all hear what I'm saying? I want God to move for me. But you won't move that plate. Or you won't downsize and eat fruits and vegetables. Do it, Daniel. Y'all ain't saying that. Oh, I don't eat lettuce. That's for rabbits. Well, I'm going to tell you tricks is for kids. Because ain't no magic trick in God. You want to think like a kid, that's what you're going to get the results like a kid. Paul said when, but listen, 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 listen. We got to understand that God got a promise, but we can't let obstacles. Who I said? Y'all know I'm most. And I go preach anyway. I don't care because the Lord is back me up. I don't, I don't try to impress nobody. <laughs> I, I, I don't try to pray nobody. It's my lane, it's my lane. I'm good in my lane. I get up and with the loud. I feel like David. David said, David, 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 you know, when he went to go bring the lunch and he found him at, at the stage of war with Goliath and in, in the armies, you know, with the Philistines. And, 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 and you know, it, it, it's something how he showed up at the right time, but it looked like to somebody else it was the wrong time. But when they tried to put all that gear on him, David said, hold on, I, I can't wait. I can't I can't fight with this right here. I ain't used to this. Y'all ain't saying that's an 
don't come and whip it that I got, baby. All I need is right here, and all I need is smooth phones, and I get the job done. Come on, y'all ain't saying nothing. I'm watching there. Thank you, God. Goliath didn't mess up. The anointing didn't really come on David until he came to get David God. Y'all ain't talking to me up in here. See, that's when the, you, you, when the enemy come in and start making heaven, he just, he just showing you that the anointing on you. But we clap our hand and put our head between our legs and we get in the pity party. We want to cry all night. But when the enemy come in and when he come at the righteous, it wake up the anointing. Y'all ain't saying that. The anointing makes it easy. You better tell that devil when you come against my God, you got to go down. You on second side, finish side. You got my shape. You might got to pass my way out. We coming out. Nothing going to hold us back. Thank you, God. Yes, God. Yes, God. Yes, God. Thank you, God. Too many passive beliefs. Too many passive. Come on. I want you to know when that devil show up. That's when the anointing coming on. Y'all hear what I'm saying? Oh. All right. Watch this here. Watch this here. The scripture says when the enemy come in like a flood, he'll do what? So that, that, that's an anointing coming. So when the enemy uptight, God's react. I want to move with God. I need the anointing that shut every weapon down. I need every anointing. You want what you meant for me to go crazy. Now you really gave me peace. Huh? Now you really gave me joy. Huh? You see, a lot of church folks don't understand that. They don't understand. I want a greater anointing. I want a greater anointing. Well, you're going to have some greater fights. You, 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 and in this fight, you can't eat no popcorn and take breaks. You can't stay on Facebook and media. You're going to have to shut everything down and get in the face of God. Come on. I ain't going to turn you loose until you bless my soul. I wrestle with you all night. I wrestle with you all week. I'm not letting you go until you bless me. This thing got to break. This witchcraft got to break. This witchcraft got to be destroyed. This demon got to go. This demon got to get out of my house. This demon got to go. So now, so now, okay. Okay. count your blessings. Name them one by one. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I gotta do this. I gotta do that. I gotta do this. I gotta do this. I got to go over yonder. I got to go back over yonder. That may be a fact that you gotta go through all of that, or you got to go do that. But the truth of the matter says your problem should not have you. You have to have control over your problem. Come on now. Come on now. Amen. Come on. Can I talk Jesus? Yeah. The cross didn't have Jesus. Jesus had the cross. Yeah. Jesus said the only power you got is what the Father gives you. Yeah. What? What? Y'all hear what y'all y'all hear what I'm saying? Yeah. Don't give place to the enemy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he gonna come, but he he, he he if you resist him, he'll flee. Yeah, yeah. That's why we gotta meditate on the word of God. Meditate on him day and night. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. We gotta get some stuff out of our system. Yeah. Cause if we don't get it out of our 
system, your faith would never grow from faith to faith and go to glory to glory. And when any time a believer faith is stuck, then they get complacent, then they get a spirit of jealousy. Why are you blessing them? No, they think they are all of that. Folk talk to them. They don't want to talk to me. Because maybe there may be something wrong with you. You don't show yourself friendly. How you going to get a friend? Amen. Don't got quiet up in here. That don't mean talking all the time now. And no, 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 let me write the Bible. I don't want to be running my talk all the time. I'm, no, I'm, 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 I'm trying to hear from God. I'm going to hear. No, 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 Good Lord, I'm glad that that's a talking woman. Good Lord, that's a talking woman. Then they'll start putting, trying to put women with another person who t- I talk this person. Boy, now that's bad then. When you try to compare another, a woman and a man, a, a man should not talk like a woman. The man ought to be a seal. Y'all, y'all done look, y'all, 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 a man ought to be a seal, come on, I want to see that demon that's trying to hit my house, I want to see that demon trying to hit the ministry, I want to see that demon trying to hit my leader, y'all ain't saying that, I need the mighty man's about it, I feel preaching up in here, he cut not my shot, he not my shot, if it ain't got nothing to do with me, I ain't coming to you, y'all ain't saying that, I don't know what happened with that, but now, now, if the Holy Ghost talk to me, I'm on your noise in my spirit, come on, y'all ain't saying that, but if God don't say it, I'm going to shout, y'all ain't saying that. Because if a woman or man talk too much and they're a preacher of the gospel, they'll, they'll talk past their anointing and don't realize it. Folks done went to Gatorade break, popcorn break, went to the mall, went to the buffet, all of that sitting right up there while you Oh, you don't want to get with me because you ain't saying nothing. Your hour will be gone. Amen. Amen. So if you're going to preach the gospel, don't talk too much. Yeah. Don't have all that idle talking. If I say idle talking, idle talking, idle talking, idle talking. Oh, you what I'm saying? Idle talking. your blessings. Name them one by one. Count your blessings. See what God have done. See what God have done. God have done. We stop counting our blessings. What's going to replace it? What's going to replace it? Misery. Pain. Frustration. He say, she say, she say. You say it. Y'all hear what I'm saying? Do we miss blessings because they are not packaged as we expected? Do we miss our blessings because it ain't I don't want USPS. I want Y'all got it. Y'all got it. And God said, 
I, I want to bring it to DH. I want to bring your blessing to DHL. Yeah, yeah. Come on. I don't want no yellow truck coming up to my house. So all that yelling, burning, and whatever it is, it's like the Amalams coming. I don't want that. Well, baby, bring it, baby. It could be a small box. <laughs> yeah. Bring it. Bring it. Bring it. Especially when I ain't got to pay for it. Bring it. Well, let me say it like this. If favor enough slacks it in half, and it probably be more, bring it. But see, what we find out, what I find out, if God ain't blessing us the way we think we ought to be blessed, we, we, we shut down on God. We bring God to a minimized state. And that's not the will of God. That's not the will of God. When we are grateful for what he's given us, he make a rule of much more. If we want more, we got to be grateful for the small stuff. And I come to find out the smallest stuff is the greatest blessing. The smallest stuff can be the greatest blessing. Y'all hear what I'm saying? The smallest stuff can be the greatest blessing. Y'all hear me? Y'all hear me? You have a, listen, do you know how much it costs for a private jet? Private jet. How much diesel it takes just to get it off the ground. A Boeing, one of the big boys, it take more diesel to go up than to fly. And then when they land, before they land, they gotta dump some fuel because they gotta be light. What you say, though? So, watch this here. If you want to go up, you can't minimize the small things because the, the, the plane costs more than the fuel. But the plane can't get in the air without the fuel. That plane cannot get in the air without the small thing. You want to climb, but you don't want to be the climber. It's going to take you facing your fears to climb. Okay, 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 okay. Well, I'm going to go a whole nother route. Because what we're expecting, God said, I got a million dollars to get one thing to you. So could I encourage you, if you got let down from one application or some whatever, I want you to think big. Take God out the bar. That means God got another door for me. That means God got another place for me. Y'all ain't talking to me. You ain't getting me all disgusted and mad because I, my application got denied. That means God got another application on this way. Y'all ain't saying that. I feel the Holy Ghost. Just Season. 
See, you want to get blessed how you want to get blessed in every season. But there are some blessings will mess your season up because you can't handle it. You fine folk can't handle money. You got to understand. You got to understand.